a video that was recorded on VHS videotape a couple of decades ago. The lens has come out. There is no capsule. And the hyaluronal face is broken and vitrectomy was done. The PI was done. Pupil is mid dilated. The eye wall is inserted from 12 o'clock tunnel, sclerocornial tunnel, and a T dialer is used to push the haptic into the anterior chamber and tuck it into the angle. Then the eye wall is rotated systematically so that it's placed horizontally at the end of the surgery. We draw it from the angle with the dialer step by step and I call it I used to call it as walk on the angle. So there is no rubbing of the angle with the haptics with the alternative pull and push technique, pull and release technique. I'm positioning it horizontally. When you position the AC lens horizontally the pain somehow is not there because it may be I used to think that the lid presses the eye every time it blinks and that pressure is conveyed to the lens and it hurts whenever it blinks forcefully or press the eye. That's totally avoided by keeping it. I'm checking it again with infusion and vitrectomy to see if there are any strands of vitreous. If it is there, it's removed. It may be good to have the pupil little smaller in size, but this also works. At the end of surgery, I uh, release the haptic from the angle and leave it, lift it up and leave it so that iris tuck is totally avoided. The eye wall sizing is generally about a millimeter larger than the white-to-white -white horizontal uh, diameter. Thank you.